So this morning we're going to be talking about pitcher's elbow. And pitcher's elbow is going to be when there's tears to the ulna collateral ligament, which we'll be looking at in just a minute. But the ulna collateral ligament extends from the humerus, which remember the humerus is the arm bone, to the ulna bone. And the ulna bone, remember, is in your forearm and it's on the side of your pinky. The function of the ulnar collateral ligament is to stabilize the elbow. And it occurs when people do repetitive motions, such as throwing, they can injure their ulnar collateral ligament. Like most sports injuries, the treatment's the same. It's gonna be rice again, rest, ice, compression, and elevation. Just don't use it for a while. Um, cross friction massage may help with this also. There's braces people can wear, but the main thing is not to pitch for a while. If it doesn't get better, they do something called Tommy John surgery. And Tommy John was a pitcher for the Dodgers. I'll be showing you a picture of him in a minute. But Tommy John surgery is done. And what they'll do is they will take out the ulnar collateral ligament and they'll get a ligament from somewhere in the body, such as from the palm of the hand, the patella tendon, which the patella tendon is the one that's in front of your knee that or just below your kneecap that usually doctors hit to, when they're testing the reflexes or a tendon from, or, I'm sorry, or a tendon from somewhere else in the body or a ligament from somewhere else in the body too. So first a little history on Tommy John surgery. Tommy John was a pitcher for the Dodgers who was actually really good. And he tore his ulnar collateral ligament. And so what happened is they did this surgery on him and when he came back, he was actually able to throw the ball faster than before he had the surgery. So this became a pretty popular surgery for pitchers, and it's pretty common. And the problem they had is because he was able to throw faster, Little League parents now wanted their kids to get Tommy John surgery, even though the kids had never had elbow pain. They wanted them to get Tommy John surgery. But anyways, this is a picture of Tommy John. And he played for the Dodgers in the 60s and the 70s. I actually saw Tommy John play as a kid. So what you're looking at here is a picture of the um, on the collateral ligament. It's all of this. Let me change this real quick. It's all of this that's right here. This whole triangular ligament makes up the on the collateral ligament. Now, if you want to know where we're at here, this is on the inside of your elbow. So this little part that's right here, this is the medial collateral epicondyle, which we talked about with golfer's elbow. It's the bump that you can feel on the inside of your elbow. And so you can see this, the medial collateral ligament or the ulnar collateral ligament, which is also known as the medial collateral ligament. Um, it's made up of three parts. It's made up of the posterior bundle, the anterior bundle, and the transverse ligament. And you can see the transverse ligaments going this way. The transverse ligament, I've seen this called the oblique ligament, and I've also seen it called the intermediate bundle. If you notice, this is saying bundle, this says bundle, and then, and this, it says ligament, but I've also seen this called the intermediate bundle. So this is my transverse right here and this parameters right here. So what you're looking at here is a tear of the ligament. This is it in the anterior bundle and the posterior bundle. Um, you have the transverse. Another, so you can see there's a tear that goes along here. So what they're going to do is they're gonna take out all of this. They will take all of this out and replace it with a ligament from somewhere else. But another fun fact, which I meant to say a second ago, coming down the back here, I don't know if you can see this, but you ha actually have a nerve that comes and it actually goes underneath this right here. It's known as your ulnar nerve. And when you hit this area right here, if you feel right below the medial epicondyle on your elbow, you can feel it's a little sensitive and there's a little like indentation there. That's where this nerve goes through. This is known as the ulnar nerve. And when you hit it, that's your funny bone. The funny bone is actually a nerve called the ulnar nerve. 
So once again, you can see we have the tears on here. And so what doctors need to do now is they need to go and replace this. Now you can get the tears anywhere on here. This is just showing the tears being right like this. And you can even just tear one. It doesn't have to be this bad. And again, you try to treat it with rice, braces. Um, you can do something called ultrasound, electric stim. There's exercise to do. And if that doesn't work, you're going to do Tommy John surgery. And so if you look here, you can see the changes that are done. We no longer have a big, broad ligament here, right? That's made up of three parts. We no longer have that. If you notice now what, we've do what doctors have done is it almost looks like a shoelace here, right? So they replaced all of that ligament that we had with this here. If you notice, they put holes in the bone and they thread it just like they do a shoe. Right? And then they put it back in here too. There's holes in the bone here. And then they basically just tie it. You know, they, they do more than just tie it, but to give you an idea, they, and they basically kind of just tie it and that'll stabilize the shoulder. But if you notice, we no longer have that big, broad uh, triangular ligament that's in there. And that's basically uh, Tommy John surgery.